Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome four-time SAG award-winning actor, Megan Mullally. Shouldn't do that. Shouldn't be doing that. Hello, good evening. Wow, this is nice. It is my great privilege to welcome you all to the 25th Annual SAG Awards. The night where Hollywood finally shines a spotlight on actors. <laughs> it's just brave. Look, I mean, come on. Everybody knows that winning a SAG award is the greatest honor an actor can receive this weekend. <laughs> but I mean, this is the place to be. I mean, come on, look at this room. Lady Gaga is here. <laughs> Honey, you are crushing it. I mean, what a year. A Star is Born has four nominations tonight. Yes. Gaga stars in it, co-wrote the music, currently has two shows running in Vegas, and she's been doing my eyeliner for the last 15 years. I mean, look, look at this, look. I mean, I, I just would, I wouldn't trust anyone else. You know you're the best. You, she was born that way. <sighs> All right, well, obviously we still have a ways to go, but in 2018, Hollywood did manage to get a few things right. They cast black people in Black Panther. So that was good. Asian people in Crazy Rich Asians. Just step in the right direction and a green book in Green Book. You know, you know there were some executives saying, um, could the book be white? <laughs> that was my favorite joke. <laughs> and to SAG nominee, the beautiful Emma Stone, who just turned 30. Our condolences. <laughs> you had a great run. I mean, like a, like a really great run. <laughs> extra, extra good. But you know, we're looking forward to your reverse mortgage loan commercials. They're gonna be great. <laughs> Chin up, yeah, good, okay. Roles for women continue to break new ground. Glenn Close played a wife, so that's new. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Melissa McCarthy portrayed a woman who repeatedly apologizes and asks our forgiveness. I was like, what? This is groundbreaking. <laughs> Emily Blunt played a nanny. And in another film written and directed by her real-life husband, John Krasinski, Emily played a mom who wasn't allowed to speak. <laughs> yeah. I mean... So great not to have to learn any lines, am I right? I mean, that was really, really thoughtful of you, John. Thank you. 